striking a pose in London's Hyde Park. But it's in India where Liverpool beauty queen Amy Jackson is a big star. The 24-year-old was spotted by a South Indian director and has gone on to star in Tamil, Telugu and Bollywood films. Down the road from her magazine photo shoot, she joined me at the BBC headquarters. I wanted to know how Amy had learned to adapt to the Bollywood style of working. I still haven't, you know, adjusted. I don't think it's a, a sense of that. I think India in general always keeps you on its toes. And um, that's what I like about it. You know, you never know what's happening from one day to the next. Um, different scenes will be added, new dialogues will be added, but that's the whole energy behind Bollywood, I think. In the past, Bollywood has been questioned about its infatuation with fair skin. That is something that has changed over time, but do you ever feel like you've been exploited because of your skin colour? Definitely not. I think India's completely changed on that sort of front. Um, I don't think skin colour comes into it, and I think the Bollywood industry is so much more than that now. Maybe, maybe 10 years ago, even um, films that are aimed just towards the male category. Now they've got women orientated films. Um, you've got girls from all over the, the world doing different films and acting in India. One of the most interesting things about your journey is that you didn't speak a word of Hindi when you began in Bollywood. How did you cope with that? How did you learn the language? I had my tutor. I worked three, four, five hours a day on my scripts, on my dialogues. And basically, um, I know the meaning obviously behind it. I know that um, how I'm supposed to emote. Cinema doesn't have a language. Cinema is about emotion. Cinema is about feeling, um, and it's about you know recognizing um, about your character, about the script. There's so much more in it. But obviously, learning the language in Tamil, Telugu, Hindi um, was vital for me, and I wanted to get an understanding for myself. Why do you think that you've made it where thousands of other British actors and actresses haven't? I think. It was all part of fate at the start, obviously, getting the chance to be over in Bollywood. I didn't actually know I wanted to be a Bollywood star or an Indian actress in a sense. Um, but I think it happened and when I realised I wanted it to happen and realised I wanted to take it seriously, I think it's all about hard work and you have to put yourself out. It's an industry where you have to be involved, you have to network. To some people Bollywood might seem like a dream but are there any negatives? Being away from home, being away from your family and um, the norms, I suppose. But it all comes pass and parcel.